Hey everyone, welcome back to day 34 of our of developing our WebGL game Galactic Greenhouse. Even though I don't have much time today, I'm planning to push the game further from chapter 12 all the way to chapter 15. Actually, I might even need to expand the, to chapter 20. I realized I missed adding lights as a component in the game, so we might need to add those extra steps extra chapters today's main goal is to extend the game up to chapter 20 and if time allows deal with the insulator logic i've already wrapped up the chapters involving conductors so now it's all about adding insulators into the mix for these chap new chapters let's dive in and see how far we can get today first off i've updated the list of chapters the game will cover Adding chapters 13 through 17 was my plan, then I jumped into updating the chapter manager and playing with the dialogue flow in what's essential should be the dialogue manager, even though it's labeled as the game manager. Renaming scripts feels like a discouraging task because of all the references tied to them, so for now I'm leaving it as is, even if it's a bit confusing. While a more organized approach for using classes for dialogue and chapter elements might make the scripts easier to manage, I am focusing on getting the game ready for the players to enjoy. After all, the players care about the gameplay experience, not the behind the scenes coding. I ran into an issue while trying to load chapter 13, but after a bit of debugging, I realized I forgot to set up the chapter elements properly. Once fixed, I started editing them. Adding new elements to chapter 13, including fans, plant free zones, and importantly, insulators. Introducing insulators brings a new puzzle element into the game, but it means I also have to create a mini tutorial so you know how to use them. Without a proper introduction, it might just cause frustration, which isn't what I want. However, I hit another issue with dropping insulators where they need to go. It's something I will need to sort out tomorrow since I'm out of fo time for today. Before we call the day, let's chat about something small but important in ga making games, what we call our scripts. It might seem minor but the names we pick for our scripts really help us and maybe others to understand what's going on in our game's code. Today I thought hard about changing the name of a key script to make it clearer it goes to show that even the little choices in coding can make a big difference in how easy it is to work with our game later on. For anyone wanting to make games, remember this. Choosing the right names can make your code a lot easier to handle, saving you and others from a lot of headaches down the line. It's all about helping our future selves and others who might work on your game. So that's where we are at, chapters, extended, insulators, introduced, but with a bit more work to ensure everything runs smoothly. Make sure that, to make sure to like this video, hit subscribe and click the bell so you don't miss out on our space adventures. Have any ideas, tips or just want to send some love? Leave a comment below, I really enjoy reading them, thanks for sticking with me through this update, I will solve these challenges first thing tomorrow, see you then, and have a great day, bye for now.